Hey fellow blade lovers, blade obsession back. Uh, Y'all probably already seen enough videos on this knife, but this is a different variation. Everybody's doing a video, it seems like, on the sow catcher, which is the leaf design or the leaf shaped blade on this. This is the regular W catcher in uh, D2. Uh, TP handle thermoplastic elastomer. I think that's what it stands for. Uh, blade is 8.7 inches. The handle is 5.5 inches. I think the sheath is 10.6. Uh, I like these uh, color combinations, but I don't like. This is made to look like a Kydex sheath, which is a good sheath, but plastic sheaths tend to, if you got a blade that's sharp, it tends to dull your blade down for some reason, they say. But yeah, this is the plain W catcher, it says, so, but it is D2, so, basically what I would call a pig sticker here in the south. <laughs> Uh, it's got like a swedge going on up here, bit of a hollow grind, or no, it might be a saber, I think it's a saber grind. I have tried to put it on the, there's the D2, I put it on a ceramic rod twice, but D2 being so hard, it's taking a while to get hard, I mean to get sharp. Uh, it's, I mean, it's... I guess it could be better for sure, but I mean, it would do the trick. I wouldn't call it dull per se, but you can see that's not the cleanest cut. It's hard to do this on camera. Well, certain areas of it are sharp and certain some of them ain't. Yeah, I need to work on it some more, I guess. But yeah, I mean, it would... I don't know if it would... Sim so, so sharp, what I call it. But it is a nice looking knife, and it's supposed to be full tang, and it does have a comfortable grip. I like the grip. There's their logo on the handle and the tang there. Kind of like those dual uh, fullers. Would definitely be nasty in a pig sticking fight. <laughs> but yeah, uh, I think I got a discount on it because I uh, had some Amazon points built up. So I might have got it for around 41. But uh, and this sheath's okay, I guess. It's just. You know, plastic. Basically plastic, but it does have some good latching points, I guess. You want to put it on a... You want to look at that blade. Yeah, it's, it's okay. It'd be good for home defense, or... If you're going after a herd of a wild boar, I guess. It's intimidating, I guess. It's pretty intimidating. I don't know if it'd be my first choice in a knife fight, though. If I can ever get it razor sharp, I probably have to put it on the work sharp to get it sharper. And get the angles perfect every time. And D2 being so hard. I think this comes in black with a black handle, too, but. Kind of like OD green and black together I always have, so whenever possible, I buy that combination. But yeah, it's almost a nine inch blade, so it's not super thick though, if you can see. I would say that's about three millimeters, maybe three and a half at the most. But yeah, I wish it was easier to sharpen. I think it's 
rock wheel hardness is around 60 to 62 so that's going to make it a little tougher to to uh, tickle up they say but uh do i like this one better than the sow catcher probably because i uh, you could i think you could probably it feels pretty sharp the spine you might be able to scrape ferro right on it but the thing i like about it the best you probably baton with it better i think it would make a better camp knife is what i'm saying than the uh the regular sow catcher so anyway that's just a quick review uh, if you like it uh give it a thumbs up give it a like maybe a comment whatever you think and I'll talk to you on the next one. Take care.